the leader of opposition at the Salon Parliament, Honorable Cherno Ramadan Majuba, during in debate for Seka President Julius Mahadabio in state opening speech at the well of Parliament, May 28 this year. And not been waste time. For make him clear one say, he not get choice but for tell thank you to President Bio and not for waiting President Bio don't do, but just for waiting he say. The Speaker, Honorable Members, I want to join the band who are gone in thanking His Excellency the President for the speech he delivered to this house on the 28th of May. But unlike what my colleague from Moyamba, the Honorable Lady said, we are thanking His Excellency for the speech he graciously delivered, not for the activities that he had accomplished. We have to distinguish the two so that the public will not be confused Honorable Ba carry on for make in second point inside in debate for attack the speechwriter or writer them of President Bio for sake of the way and manner how he say the document we get the short version of the speech with President Bio gin at the well of parliament during in state opening speech quite different in content format from the complete version of the same document we MP them gets as the president in speech. I'm going through the two documents we received. That is the speech that was laid, which is extensive, and that of the abridged version that was delivered in this house, which I also want to believe, God willing, next year there will be no COVID, and this will be the first and perhaps also the last time for something similar to happen in this house. We want to make sure that the speech that is laid for us to debate is also consistent with that which is delivered by His Excellency the President. No. Mr. Speaker, I, I don't want to say few because it came from right across the aisle, from that side and on this side, and the center, that um, the speech writers are not doing justice to His Excellency the President. No, no. We are not faulting His Excellency, we are faulting the speech writers. And we are, we are thankful that we still have people like Dr. Abbas Bumbu still with us in this country. They should be utilizing your expertise, Mr. Speaker. Yes, sir. We know that you are not just a brain, but you are, also, you are also an expert in speech writing. Unfortunately, I become who is not here. I will not say everything that I know because you will not want me to say them. But I'm sure that not to write the speech, but if you guide them well, they could do far better than what we have before us today. Still on the president in speech, the leader of opposition, Honorable Bar, look inside the education sector and how he said the figure where the president in speech writer or writer them give for sake of the amount of picking them where they benefit from the free quality education different from the figure where the Ministry of Finance give inside one document this BNTM. We have still not seen the quality side of the free, free education. And Mr. Speaker, Again this morning, like the President's speech stated, those that are receiving benefit from the free quality education were tagged at 2 million. But a few days ago, a statement in the form of a release from the Ministry of Finance gave us a figure that is less than 2 million. The figure of itself, Mr. Speaker, the figure that was published was approximately 1.85 million. 1.85 million. The Ministry of Finance confirmed that they have paid second term fees, even though we are now on the third term, but that's okay. But that they have paid fees for 1 million 800 plus students. And it's in black and white. And it was published by the Ministry of Finance. The nearest decimal could have been 1.85 or 1.9, but two, a hundred thousand difference is a huge chunk. So again, for the speech writers, let them make sure and ensure all the time that they get their figures right before passing them over to His Excellency the President for his pronouncement. Because his words are policy. I maintained that the last time and I will repeat that again.
Honorable Ba again inside page 6 of the president in speech. Notice other big faults we according to Ram. Now where the speech writer or writer them cut and paste directly within first term president Ernest by Kuruma been talk about one veterinary hospital na teko barracks inside Makini. And Mr. Speaker, I don't know whether I don't know whether it's again as a result of the speech writers or it's a deliberate mistake. When you go under agriculture, Mr. Speaker, on page six, uh, His Excellency's speech, he said, amongst other things, that the rehabilitation of the Teco Central Laboratory and the equipment of same, amongst others. I wonder which of the Teco we are talking about. Because the Teco I know is the Teco in Makeni, and the laboratory that is at the Teco Barracks as we speak. Which speech are you? From His Excellency's speech. <laughs> Mr. Speaker. Yes, sir. Page 6. Paragraph 36. Says, Government has renovated the Teco Central Veterinary Laboratory and equipped them with modern laboratory facilities for the diagnosis of the majority of the endemic animal diseases prevalent in the country. I don't know who did this speech again for His Excellency the President, because these were the words of President Koma, former, in 2017. And I was present myself when that laboratory was open after its refurbishment in 2017. It is visible, you can go to McKinley and see it. Nothing has happened in that laboratory since the end of the APC government in April of Nothing has happened. I think by in that case... When last was there? When last was there? Please listen to the speaker. In that case, Mr. As the area or see, this be make some big people them at the well of parliament move from them sit them and plenty grumble being come out from different part them at the well of parliament and the speaker of parliament self honorable Dr. Abbas Chernobundu and the deputy leader of government business honorable Bashiru Siliki no been beer but been get for coming for defend the president in speech writer. Yes, Mr. Speaker. Maybe he wanted to refer to us the former government. I think the fault attributed less to the speech writer and more to the contributors from the various MDAs. I agree with you. I agree with you, Mr. Speaker. I agree with you. I agree with you. Definitely. But they should be verifying these things. Yes, um, Mr. Speaker, what the opposition now say? In 2007, he was there when... Not 2007, 2017. 2017, he was there when... Uh, when it was refurbished no, and launched. Yes, what, what the president simply said is government has innovated. It's also innovating and... <laughs> <laughs> of course. Mr. That's not what I'm saying. You have said what I was saying. What I am saying, Mr. Speaker, is that since it was refurbished and launched, Nothing has happened. No, 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 no. That's what I'm saying. No, no, I beg that to is what I am not saying. Not Mr. You, you, have, you have never been there. You don't know the place. In fact, Mr. Speaker, you see, as I said, Mr. Speaker, we are in the house. We are under oath. I don't want us to score political points. We are not here to score political points. We are not here to score political points. Black TV Online been trying for get response from State House on this issue, but not been succeed. Although Honorable Barr talk on other issue them inside President Bill in speech, the question with plenty people go on for ask now why the leader of opposition spend plenty of in term for fan faults on the president in speech and they attack the speech writer. But as you hear from Honorable Cherno Barr, not to for score any political point, but for help the government for improve. For Salon Parliament, I on Bla TV Online. Mina Abdullah Bla the reports.